Hello and welcome again to another V2I Mining, Gas and Resources presentation. Thank you for joining us. Today's presentation is a great example of our ability to take complex information and deliver it as a simple, easy to understand message. This particular presentation is an extract from a recent project we undertook for Extrata to help effectively communicate their restricted access and no-go zone procedures for their long wall operation. There are many applications for our high definition 3D visualization digital knowledge transfer technology, particularly in relation to OHS, training, induction, assembly and disassembly, maintenance operations, logistics and mining efficiencies, just to name a few. If we can assist you and your organization to more effectively address some of these issues, we'd love to hear from you. Thank you for watching and please let us know what you think of this material so we can continually improve and develop better processes and better outcomes. Thank you for watching and bye for now. Shield Chalk Advancing. It is important to note that when the shield is advancing either through automation or adjacent control, there is no standing on the front of the shield, on the shield or in front of the shield on the relay bar, which can drop onto your foot as it moves into position to advance the shield. There are also dangerous pinch points because of the varying distances between the pan and the shield. In this operation, the entire shield and the ground between the adjoining shields is a no-go zone. When the shield is moving, there is high potential for being caught by the shield or crushed between the shield and the pan. It's important to understand that a moving shield is an unstable platform to step on. We cannot emphasize enough that a person could lose their balance and fall. Shield in push mode. Given there is a limited space for miners on the shields, the area on the pontoons and into the back of the shield is restricted access. Once again, the operator in control of the relative equipment and crew must always be aware of persons in this area and restrict numbers wherever possible. When a shield is pushing out to position the pan, the entire area in front of the pontoon to the pan line, including the relay bar, is a no-go zone. The moving relay bar can slide over your foot if you have your feet anywhere near the bar. 